लियोन हाउ आर यू फाइन सागर सो लियोन वेस्ट ब्रिज आनंद चेस अकेडमी वाका वेन डिड यू गेट टू नो अबाउट इट एंड वॉट वॉज योर रिएक्शन वेन यू गॉट टू नो दैट यू आर वन ऑफ द पीपल सिलेक्टेड फॉर इट okay when i got to know it know about it uh, was like just before like i would say around 2020 towards the end i don't remember when exactly but towards the end i was playing in europe some tournaments but uh, as soon as i became a gm like soon after like maybe the next day or after day or two uh, vishyanand sir sent my father a, a whatsapp message where asking whether i would like to join and of course i obliged him Yeah. and when when your father told you about it were you excited actually we thought it was some kind of hoax because he just casually messaged it was just some we didn't like like a world champion just casually messaging me on whatsapp and hi would you like to see some chess with me it's like <laughs> we were very surprised so but yeah once we got to know it was true then we were just super excited and yeah i mean it's awesome this whole thing and uh, when the classes began how were they like uh, do you remember your first class yeah i think if i'm not mistaken it was 4th of february but in the beginning of february it was sandeepan sir's class and yeah i mean that time when it just started during the pandemic the classes were very regular because it, it was the pandemic right so i think uh, yeah I, i learned a lot during all those classes and it was uh, really helpful for me what were the sessions like like for example there were four different trainers and what did you gain from each one of them uh, so in the beginning like just when it started there were more like uh, sandeepan sir used to train us for mostly middle games and a bit of openings and uh, yusupov sir used to focus on end games or sometimes he would just show the game from the beginning and we would think from the beginning and then it would reach some end game or the other and those those games would really take long like uh, we would have two hour classes so maybe four classes for that one game What? so eight hours just on one game so wow. yeah we discussed a lot in those uh, in in just one game so it was amazing Do, don't you think like spending eight hours for one game is a bit too much or does it help you um no it, it's definitely not too much i mean the more you can discuss the more you just learn it, it doesn't matter one game or 100 games it's just what you discuss Hmm. So yeah I, I honestly I didn't feel it was 8 hours that I've gone over for whatever 4 weeks but uh, and yeah Gaevsky sir used to show us mainly openings and opening ideas and whatever recent that has popped up yeah and later of course uh, Gelfand sir had some sessions that was during 2021 I guess uh and uh, he basically showed his own games so he can explain his own thought process and of course that's very insightful when a top player explains the thought process and we discuss it together he makes us think also and we compare our thoughts and he explains to us what he thought during the game so of course it's very beneficial so uh, apart from these trainers were you training with someone else also in this period yes of course vishnu sir was always, uh, was my trainer since 2018 and i've been training with him also still till the present day yes yes and what would you say that waka has added to your chess in general because you have been constantly going upwards in rating wise i think th- this last period was maybe the you've dropped uh, 10 elo points or so but from becoming a gm 2500 to reaching 2570 it has been an upward trend yeah i mean i can't think of anything specific right now but uh, in my general thinking of course i think it has helped a great deal and uh, like uh, i mean many instances uh, when there are many end games that appear like uh, in my games and uh, many of these concepts that yusuf of sh- sir has showed us in rook end games we discussed a lot of rook end games mainly many of those concepts i have seen in my games and uh, yeah i mean middle games of course like sandeepan sir was always g- showing us some very interesting ideas so much like i find shocking honestly but uh, it i mean i'm just amazed these ideas appear in the position so basically basically i would say my thinking just broadened and yeah my perception improved a lot and how was it working with anand yeah, yeah it was awesome like uh, we would just analyze and analyze and it was amazing to see how we uh, he he could just keep on analyzing for so long and like just go and delve into the depths of every position and i, I like that a lot about him 
you could just analyze and like forget about the computer at all yeah. and was it like at first a bit like overwhelming to to you know work with anand did you get used to it yes in the beginning it was like i was a bit shy and all but later he just made us feel completely fine with it and he was just like mainly focused on the chess so we just got into the groove and continued with it amazing and do you do you recollect uh, any specific moment or any thing that you learned from the sessions which proved useful in your practical games mm -hmm. i wouldn't say anything specific but uh, maybe an opening idea uh, gaevsky sir showed us i think i used it in one of the games do you remember maybe i shouldn't give the opening idea right oh. <laughs> so you used that and you were able to win i'm not sure but i was very happy because i was, I was out of ideas basically <laughs> so so basically uh, vaka sessions do help you to keep on having getting new ideas yeah and also it helps you to have more sort of partners right because all of you work together how is that feeling of working together yeah of course that that always helps like working in a group with uh, all strong players it definitely helps even like the coaching is of course great but then when you're in such a strong group it uh, of course it always helps